click the bell icon to get latest videos from Ikeda. Hello friends, in the previous lecture we have discussed about what are the group 16 elements as well as we have also discussed about the electronic configuration that is the general electronic configuration. And now in this topic we are going to talk about the occurrence of group 16 elements. So where does this group 16 elements occurs? That is what I want to talk about in this topic. So friends, now I'm going to talk about the occurrence of group 16 elements. So starting the first one, that is oxygen. So talking about oxygen, oxygen is the most abundant element in this earth and around that is 46.6 percentage by mass of earth crust is covered with oxygen. And if you talk about that is air, in air basically 21% by volume of air is covered by oxygen so therefore this is the abundance of the oxygen and this is what we can find everywhere and talking about the next one that is suppose if I'm talking about the next element that is sulfur so talking about sulfur sulfur is present in a very less quantity in fact if I would say that is it is around 0 0.03 to 0.1 percentage of sulfur by mass is basically present on the earth crust so this is what the quantity of sulfur is so sulfur can be found in the form of sulfides as well as sulfates so based on that let me give you a few examples suppose if i'm talking about that is sulfides so talking about sulfides then we the common example that we know is galena which is also written as pbs we can also write it as zinc blend that has a basically molecular formula that is ZNS. So therefore this are nothing but sulfides. But as I mentioned earlier, that is it is being found in sulfates also. So that's the reason, suppose if I'm talking about sulfates. So therefore this owes the common example that I'm going to talk about where we can find sulfur is gypsum salt. So this is what I'm going to talk about that is the gypsum salt that is nothing but CaSO4 along with that of 2 moles of H2O so therefore this is gypsum salt and suppose if I'm talking about ipsum salt even the ipsum salt will consist of sulfur and the sulfur is present in the form of MgSO4.7H2O so therefore this are the occurrence as well as this is where we can find sulfur so this was related to oxygen and sulfur now let's talk about the next elements so these two elements are basically found in sulfide ores in the form of metal selenides and metal tellurides. So this is what I want to talk about and now let me talk about the next one that is the last one that is polonium. So talking about polonium, polonium is basically a radioactive element that was been discovered by Marie Curie and since she was of Poland so obviously the name has been given as polonium. So this was related to the name of polonium and now let me talk about that how does the polonium occurs and where do we find that is polonium polonium is basically a decay product of uranium and thorium and it is a very radioactive element and this is what it is present in that is rarest amount in the earth crust so that's it this is what i want to talk about so this were related to the occurrence of group 16 elements as well as the percentage related to it. that's how much quantity of those elements are being present on the earth crust so that's it so thank you friends for watching this video i hope you have understood this video very clearly and i hope i'll see you next time till then don't forget to subscribe ekra channel thank you so much